Welcome back to Good Morning Vale and thanks for joining us on this Friday morning. Now we're talking about skiing and snowboarding, but we're going to take a more serious twist to things right now and talk about underprivileged children and how they may go hungry sometimes. One lady in our community is changing all that with Food Rescue Express and I'd like to introduce you to Tony Burns. We have to give you a big kudos because you're really changing lives for kids. Ski Patrol has decided to help out and we have Bryce May here with us. But first, Tony, tell me what Food Rescue Express is. We're a food pantry and we work with um, Eagle County School Early Childhood Education and these are kids who are below the poverty line on and they're a little bit hungry. They and don't I have enough food for the weekend. Mm -hmm. They are chosen by um, family services coordinator and they go through to decide what kids need food. So they give us the list, they're carefully chosen, and then we provide food to them. Here's next week's meal for the weekend, breakfast, lunch, and dinner for Saturday, breakfast, lunch, and dinner for Sunday, and a piece of fresh fruit. What a great service that you provide. And you we started We try to this do it healthy, nutritional food. Mm -hmm. I like that. I appreciate that about you. And now Tony's been working for about seven years now, started off with about 50 kids, up to 98 kids. Thankfully, Ski Patrol decided they're going to help you out because you're running the I-70 corridor. You go from gypsum all the way to Vail. So Bryce, how did Ski Patrol get involved? Well, the Ski Patrol wanted to reach out and help one of the local nonprofits in town. And we had, there's what, 100 or 200 different nonprofits. And Tony, represents the most grassroots of them all. She is a woman that is truly in need and uh, someone that the ski patrol really can resonate with, that what she's doing, going out and helping these kids, it's what we're all about, going out and helping people in the community. Right, and, it's uh, great. That's it's great. great, it's a lot of fun. Tony is, how can you not help this woman? I know, well, <laughs> because she's helping the kids out and a lot of studies show that these underprivileged kids that are hungry, when they go home for the weekends, they pretty much can stay hungry. So you're changing that for kids and it's really taking it grassroots, as Bryce said, because you're a one woman show with a few volunteers. Well. We also have a board of directors. It's all volunteer. Mm -hmm. No one gets paid. As of today, we have 11 schools between Down Valley and Up Valley. We have 98 kids as of today, which is 588 meals we pack and distribute. On a weekly basis? Mm -hmm. Okay, yes. so that's a lot of work. So it's nice to have Ski Patrol involved and any other volunteers. But let's take a look. What she does is she packs up a backpack, delivers it to the school, and this is for one child. But if there's one child in need in the family and there happens to be other kids, she will stock this pack for all of the kids in the family. So you get some something healthy, you get some really good stuff. And you know what I love that you do, Tony, is you actually serve food that kids are going to eat. So we it doesn't try go to, to do it kid friendly. Yeah, which is perfect <laughs> because kids like juice boxes and spaghetti and meatballs and tomato soup and things like that. So they really kind of hit the target. Now, you probably need money, volunteers, food. How can somebody help that's that's feeling moved this morning? We have a website that you can go to to find out more information about our program, foodrescueexpress.org. There's information on there. You can find out who supports us, mm -hmm. and you can send us an email. Most important, thank you, Alpine Bank, for this time. Yeah. We really, really appreciate it. And they're going to be giving them some food as well. Okay, Bryce, off subject of food, where should we be skiing today <laughs> on Vail Mountain? Where should we be skiing? Well, yeah. I just came in from Vail. It mm -hmm. was snowing lightly. Good. Uh, you know, the mountain is skiing great. The back bowls are getting a little thin in some of the spots. Mm -hmm. Blue sky in China opened yesterday. There is some nice All snow. Right. By the end of the day, this weekend, it's going to be fantastic. It's going to be good. Okay, yeah. Bryce, thank you for helping out, Tony. Tony Burns, thank you so much for what you do thank in our community. Thank you for having us. Thanks for coming in today. All right, Bryce tells us that we can be skiing uh -huh. Vail, and there's going to be a little powder out there, and the skiing is good. Let's confirm that with Trisha, who's hanging out at Mountain Plaza.